All right, well, uh, you. I don't know what really came over me. I went and bought these things. Um, old homemade speakers. Um, guy claimed they had Wolfendale drivers, and they certainly do have a, a Wolfendale tweeter. Uh, I think that people often refer, maybe refer those to a fried egg tweeter. Kind of look like a fried egg vest. Um, and I suspect the woofer is Wolfendale as well, although it doesn't explicitly say it's Wolfendale. It does say it's made in England. But I managed to pry one of them apart. Um, <laughs> whoever made them certainly did put some effort into uh, making them sealed. Had to go all the way around with a putty knife to, uh, to get them unsealed. But surprise, surprise, they actually do have a crossover. Very simple one, but a uh, crossover nonetheless. Um, I'm wondering whether just changing the caps might uh, might improve the sound a little bit. But uh, inside, oh, look at that. Inside, we do have a cast alloy frame, and uh, made. Let me see that zoom in. Will it focus? Ah, made in England. So. Um, funny, funny old-fashioned square magnet. Um, doesn't say Wolfendale anywhere on it, but uh, one could assume, I guess. 3DDC 8-inch. Hmm. You could buy now. Yeah, here's the Wolfendale tweeter. But yeah, they don't sound too bad. Um, they don't sound nearly as exciting as the uh, the Phillips there. Um, I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do with the things. I don't know. I don't know, I just thought, old speakers don't look like shit, must have. So yeah, they, uh, the guy reckon they did 40 hertz. Um, I think that's a bit optimistic, to be honest. Um, 50 hertz is probably a bit more realistic. Um, they've got a good quality, uh, pure rubber surround. Um, yeah, they don't don't have a huge amount of excursion, but yeah, they uh, sound okay. Hmm, I'm not going to bother hooking them up because you won't get anything through this camera's shitty microphone. So yeah, no no covers unfortunately. Looks like they never actually even had any. I don't see any uh, evidence of uh, any Velcro or anything. So hmm. Anyway, so yeah, my plan was is if, uh, if the um, Philips has turned into good, good uh, boom boxes to to make another set to to sell and see what I can get for it, just to test the market as it were. I bought two uh, two suitcases from the thrift shop, four bucks a piece. One, two, one, two nice looking ones. They're uh, roughly the same size. So yeah. I don't know. I probably could make back my money at least. Now that I know the drivers are quality. And actually there's a crossover. So, yeah. Anyway, catch you later.